Testing, testing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Uh, uh. Hello, everybody. Smoke cross time. It is time for the uh, downfall of your boy. I'm actually quite well, thank you. Um, so we've didn't we've not had much time at all. The track literally released fourteen-ish minutes ago. Um, so I've only done about three laps so far, and I am on the stock <laughs> Husky, Husky, not Husky, stock Honda setup that I use for Supercross. And even if the quali track feels a little bit choppy and rough in some places, so a little bit nervous to see how it's going to go on the race version. But I think we can all agree, oh, based off first impressions, you can tell it's a JV track from how good that it looks. And it's my home race. We're at Matley Basin. We are in Great Britain in the United Kingdom and not got much else more to say really I'm just trying to learn my way around the track a little bit learn how big the jumps are because I'm sure you guys can relate we've all played Winchester and Winchester MXON so much that we're used to those layouts of Matley so actually having a proper one now is uh, a little bit strange like this section is really really oh tricky and technical switching from side to side oh there's a hell of a lot of traction, I will say that. Like, really, really bad. I'll say not bad, bad as in bad as in good. Like there is an overwhelming amount of traction on the 250s. I'm not sure about fours. Um, but uh, the reason I'm riding a 250 today rather than 450, I put a poll out earlier. Not sure how many of you saw that. Um, it, boys, shut the fuck up about 250s. Jesus Christ. They said it will be out today. It is still today. We've still got a few hours to go. Oh. <laughs> I like how the thing is, if they hadn't mentioned anything, people wouldn't even be asking when they are. But they've given a date, then it is still that date. So it's fine, we got time. I've been told that it will be done after this to cause no issues with the updates and stuff. So wait until after all this racing is done, and you might have some lovely new two strokes to ride. That's all I can say. <laughs> it's alright, sport. Like, honestly, it's the amount of times I've seen that question so far today is unreal. Like, it's actually crazy. I've gone as far as in my uh, Discord server to make it so if anyone mentions the word stroke or strokes that you get an automatic, automated message saying that it is at some point today. There's no like exact time at all. Oh, I've got Harry's racing. Nice. Didn't know Harry was doing this. I haven't seen him in, uh, in a hot minute. So we've got some sections here on this track, like this section here that is quite a little bit of chop before you hit a drop off that can cause the back end to uh, step out. Oh, you can see it's a little bit twitchy, jumping into some of the corners, but I think, for me today, I'm actually not expecting much at all. Like, you know I'd much prefer my Supercross than my outdoors. So, we're just going to see how it goes. <laughs> oh, there we go. Yeah, apparently there's a video going up, which... Oh, apparently it goes live in two hours' time, so maybe they're releasing in two hours, maybe they're releasing in like three hours because they want the video to go up first, so, I don't know, put, put a three-hour timer somewhere on your phone or something, maybe you'll uh, you'll get them then. Um, I don't think, so the uh, the famous quad here at Matley, I don't think this is doable on a 250. That's a pretty solid run there, stretching it out. Uh, oh, I mean, I wasn't <laughs> I wasn't going to make it anyway, but, oh, that's fine. So, um, we've got one here. I saw someone with the name JV on the timing earlier, and there is no JVs in here. Very weird. Oh well. Um, so now, what have we got? So we've got 10 minutes practice. I thought that would have gone straight into qualify. I'm going to try to set a lap just in case, because the last thing I want is for the servers to uh, mess up a little bit. I would much rather oh, have a lap sorted. You see right there, that's my biggest concern about this hill. As you start hitting them bumps, the back end catches traction, then throws you down. So, it's going to be very interesting. I've not touched the race version of this track at all yet. So, we'll see what happens when we get there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Now, I would like to say yes 
to if for me doing all the GPs, but I feel like some of it might conflict with real life at some point, so I might not be able to do every single round. If that is the case, and I'm not actually in like a points race or battle at all, uh, I might do one or two 450 rounds as well to see how they feel. Uh, I'd like to do most of them, but yeah, you know, I've got a life. I have to make time to go and uh, go and see my girlfriend every now and then as well. And with aerial races being on a Friday and these being on a Monday, doesn't really leave me much time to travel four hours up the country to go and visit her. Or well, at least I, I have no desire to go and spend two and a half ish, three days there and that's it, and then have to come back again just for MX bikes, you know? Oh, okay. Front end's feeling a little bit lively. That corner is going to be hella tricky as well because it's got bumps all the way through it and it's off camber. I feel like the bike just wants to rock forwards and backwards a whole bunch. Just want to get my jump timing down, that's the important thing. But you see how much traction we've got on the uh, the rear end, front end's getting a little bit, a little bit lively. Oh, get back on the track. Oh! Who's this here? Pat Sheehan. I know that man. Get on the binders. Oh. Very tricky that corner. It really wants to take your front wheel away from you. Oh, okay, don't need to go that wide around there. Let's try fifth gear, see if it straightens the bike up a little bit more. Lovely. Oh, I can't get on the brakes. Look at that. I hate that like little wobbly effect when it kicks your back wheel up and then front wheel and you've got no control over where you're going. Oh, and these double doubles are stretch as well. Flat landing this is going to be a nightmare, but that was fine. Oh, land on the bumps. I like that the track has got a little bit of character to it, so like where Qatar was just completely flat. This uh, this qualifying version has a few bumps, no no ruts as such, but it's a little bit rougher. It's not like you can just keep it pinned absolutely everywhere. Oh god, am I even going to be able to triple this? Oh. No idea what sort of lap times I should be looking at. No idea who else is doing the 250 season with me, but we'll um, we'll see as we get into the races. See who's in the servers. I feel like going triple, triple, single here might be the best, uh, the best practice. Oh. I'm torn between gears a lot of the time so far, it seems, around here on shifting up or staying in a lower one. Oh god, this is not nice. I'm hoping this lap counts, I went on the inside of that white marker a bit. Throw her sideways. Oh, don't go off, don't go off. Ooh. And I want to jump left a little bit on the face of this because I keep jumping too far to the right and going off the track. Lovely. Oh, don't crash. Oh, there's two little bumps there that caught me out nearly. What was that? 2.11. Yeah, I have no idea what... <laughs> I have no idea what sort of times I should be aiming for. I'm in, I'm in a, a bit of a no-man's land in terms of groups because I signed up really late where I was leaving it for everyone. Mid, mid, mid. I agree. I agree. You're not late, Rum. Um, I don't think it's started yet. Uh, in terms of qualifying, it, it went. It was like a 10-minute practice followed by another 10-minute practice. Uh, race starts whenever it starts. I'm afraid I, I cannot give you times. Uh, I'm not an admin. All I can do is speculate. Maybe like. 45 minutes or so, because we've got to wait for half an hour's worth of qualifying to be done. And then I don't, oh, I don't know if they're doing LCQs or if they're just doing top 35 go straight through and then the next 35 go through to a B main. So yeah, we're, we're doing 35 people on the gate. Oh, there we go.
We're just gonna ride around. I mean, like the lap time that I done last lap. Obviously, there was mistakes in there. It's it weren't the quickest thing in the world. It felt okay. I'm sure you could probably get some weirdos getting probably like 206s or something like that. Uh, especially with a good setup, I think that would help a lot. You can see how much I'm having to slow down in these uh, these downhill corners when my bike's skipping about a bunch. But I feel like even a 211 would get me straight through in the top 35, which is all I want. I just want to make it in, and then we'll go from there. We'll try and improve from that point. Uh, it depends how the points is going on if I'm staying in 250s for the full season, because I might not even be able to do every single round. So if I'm like not even in with a chance of winning, then I might change class here and there on the week, depending on how I feel. So I don't know if it's faster to apex these corners or rail right around the outside. Oh god. I noticed that the, the track is uh, quite narrow in some places. I find myself getting very, very close to the edges. And the brakes here. Definitely think going slightly wider in that corner is better because then you've not got to try and turn the front end but on the really steep bit. Hugging inside there is better. You see I just gained like 0.28 on my uh, my good lap. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. All right. I want to watch what happened in uh, replay there if I can because that's happened a few times. Let's go orbit. Oh, can we watch it? We can. Right. Let's just watch this real quick. I'll slow it down, see where it went wrong. Oh, actually, I don't think it will let me slow it down. Oh, no. Screw it. Yeah, oh, so it's mm, it's just timing of when I hit the bumps. Might be worth going further outside, maybe-ish. Not too sure. Oh, oh J hang on. This is unfair. JV himself is racing. What's going on here? <laughs> Same as when Stone Rider does. To be fair, he, um, he asked me at, before the season even started if I was racing, because if I wasn't, I could have done some uh, some testing of the tracks for him. But unfair advantage if uh, I get the tracks super early and I get to race as well. Um, well, it's it's going to be changed now, Solberg. So, like, no max ping issues this time. But what's going to happen once Piboso pulls his finger out and releases an update that is currently being worked on is anybody over the ping I believe can still race you just uh, there's there's a new way that collisions and stuff are going to work that is going to be kind of a bit more like sim where really high ping riders go invisible and stuff so they can't screw over other riders I just know that's being worked on at the moment I can't really give you all of the ins and outs but Things are moving in the background. At least I hope so. I don't see any point in them like still having like a really strict pingling it limit and making people like non collidable. I would like to think that they can have the ping limit at let's say 400 or whatever, which I don't think even the Aussies and Brazilians go over, um, and then just have the uh, the collisions thing be the one that's affected. Because whilst it is hella annoying getting into uh, some of the laggy people, like I know I've said a few interesting words to Isaac <laughs> in, uh, last round because I was getting into him on the start straight and getting fucked over by it, but like, you're just trying to race and play the game at the end of the day. Like, it's not really your fault with where you're from. And it would be nice being able to uh, race against as many good people as possible regardless of what their ping is. Oh god, I've, so, I've got bloody stock Winchester in my mind so much. I keep turning a little bit too far on the jumps. Alright, can I skip this bump that's here? Oh, that's nice. Go, like, cut it a little bit tighter and then go round. Oh, okay. Surprised that I'm still at the top of this group, at least, with that time, because it didn't feel amazing whatsoever. Well, I don't know whether to fully agree with that, Solberg, because I race against Chicken a hell of a lot, and... But he has such an advantage when it comes to like close battles. So if we try block passing him, he just won't move or feel it. But as soon as he tries block passing us, we just get ejecto CO'd. So I don't know. I think it's a bit of give and take. I know that Ryder literally said earlier today that he, I mean he had 500 ping in the last round, and he said it was such a big advantage because people were just wadding all around him where he was hitting them, but he wasn't hitting them.
I might have to just like pin a comment saying two strokes are out when they're out because I feel like it's going to be a recurring question in this stream. And I don't know, I don't know why people think I know. I wish I knew because then I could literally pin the answer and people would know. Maybe I'll just say after after this race. I suppose that's a nice easier easier one, isn't it? Yeah, just put a ban on the word stroke. <laughs> or two stroke. It's just been so triggering seeing in all the discords people asking. It's like someone will ask someone to give an answer and then two messages later someone will ask again even though it's still on your screen the answer that was given to the other person so even if you're on a phone or a bloody tablet or whatever it is you're using discord on just look up two messages and you can see it now i'm actually being a bit naughty at the moment neil um i've got a chest protector that i've downloaded but not dragged into the game yet to cover up the gear because i am number 357 not 35 this is just the supercross gear <clears throat> right. Oh, we only got 20 minutes of qualifying. Okay. Fine. Well, let's go. Oh! <clears throat> right, let's go again. That's an interesting car. Or ambulance. Just bit, oh, look how nice the track looks, man. So pretty. Essentially, Solberg, so what's going to happen is you'll see how this guy's turned invisible right now as I'm getting into him and near him. Anyone with high ping, that will happen to, um, but the collisions will work the same. So if I rode through him just then, he would crash and I wouldn't. Like for people with super high ping. So anyway, you are going to be getting fucked over. Chicken's not happy with it. Well, not the best way to start quality. I want to... I need to try and work out a, like an actual consistent, smooth way down that hill. Alright, let's try and just get a banker lap, as I like to call it. Let's get a lap in with hopefully not, not wadding myself. <laughs> Mophead, that's because it is a real track. <laughs> like Winchester MXON is based off of the real track, Matterley Basin, which is where we are racing, which is one of the rounds of the actual MXGP, and has been a Motocross of Nations track in years past as well, but it exists. That's why she's looking a little bit familiar to you. JV has not just copied Poboso stock track, I promise you. <laughs> oh, I keep, I keep scrubbing that one too hard, because I think it's the one before the quad, so I need to sort that out a little bit. Try keep it in further, nice and smooth on the throttle. There we go. Let's just keep third again. No point me keep shifting up and down for no reason. Sections like this where I'm unsure if I want third or uh, fourth gear. And this one, this one's a lot smaller than I expect. And then try and go a bit fast. Can I scrub off a bit of speed on it? Oh, I can a little bit. And then I just don't know what to do here. Like this is. I think the race version is even rougher than this as well, so it's going to be hella difficult. Uh, triple, triple, single. Hopefully the front end doesn't go on me. Oh, it's trying. Yeah, it do be trying. Now there's an outside down here. I kind of want to try, see if it holds me. Oh, it's not very deep at all. It's okay though. It's not terrible. I don't know if it's if it's worth it. On the binders. Third gear. Jump a bit further left than I have been. Lovely. Hug this inside. Keep it in third gear. Alright, I want to break a bit harder here. Swing out left more. That's too far left. God damn it. <laughs> that cost me time. What was that? 2.096. Oh, it was literally what was that two seconds faster than what I'd done earlier. That was alright. 
race version is a lot more rough. Yeah, I watched um, the preview videos that JV done and it scares me because this track feels rough to me on this setup, the stock one. So I'm not excited to be uh, bounced around even more. I'm going to have to just be so patient. Uh, just like riding through the bumps, take it nice and easy. So I think it comes out at 9 my time zone, or at least that video does. So if that is the case, if they release at exactly the same time that that video drops, then it will be in 2 hours and 50, no, 1 hour and 50 minutes, 1 hour and 40 minutes. So they might even be released before uh, all of this is finished. Well, I'm happy that I'll be in with that 209 into the uh, the A the A motos. I would leave and go and try out the um, the race one, but one of the admins sent a message like if you leave, your time might not count. I think that's if everyone leaves the server. If there's no one left in the server and it rolls over, then it won't grab the results. I don't know if I trust there to be at least one person left in here by the end of quality. That's fine, we don't need practice, that's what the first moto's for. Oh, that's sharper, or tighter of a turn than I thought. Oh, easy does it. And throw her sideways over here. Probably practice starts a little bit as well because they're going to be a huge thing. I like, imagine getting stuck behind 30 plus people while one of the other fast guys are out in front. You're going to be losing so much time. Oh, back end feels so light around that corner. Uh, the racing, no, the tracks in practice and quality are different just to imitate real life a bit more. It's like a qualifying track you wouldn't really expect to be super rough, and then the racetrack you would do, because it's had all the qualifying done on it. I think it I think it makes sense. I suppose it gives you a bit more value for your money as well, because I'd really say that the qualifying tracks are easier, so if you're buying tracks and you want an easier version, then just uh, you can play the quality version rather than the race version. Yeah, the race version will be a hell of a lot rougher than this is. Try second gear. Oh. We could try a hug like far left, see if we can kind of scrape off any time just in track distance. What's the inside like up here? Oh, I lost time there, so outside. Don't know what to do in this. So this section is going to be so choppy and rough as well. I'm losing time everywhere. Maybe that was actually a decent lap by them. Whoa, keep her going. Jeez. Yeah, racing 250s. I put a poll up for, uh, for you guys because I was undecided and the majority went with 250s at the time. So we're doing twos. Yeah, it'd be nice if the 450s were better. I couldn't imagine trying to ride one round here. The front end would just be an absolute nightmare. Oh my god. Bike just disappeared. Actually, imagine being point three down after one body corner. Try being nice and smooth on the brakes there, it felt pretty decent.
don't even know if it is possible to double over them cleanly. Oh god. This is sketchy trying to go for a fast lap round here. You gotta be on the limit. Preferably not on the limits of the track, Jesus. Just a hug a nice inside line here. Lovely, you're only 0.5 down, could still gain that back before the end of the lap. That's exactly what I uh, meant by the bike skipping about. Have a look at this. Just like front end catches, back end goes, front end catches, back end goes, front end catches, and then it puts you down on the ground. Not sure how to counteract that, if I'm honest. I know that tyres make a big uh, make a big difference to it as well, but. I Quite like the tyres I've got on the uh, mid soft 80s on the front and 120s on the rear. Oh, that's one way to settle up. I'm stopping for this corner. Ooh. Kind of like turning early before that drop off and then uh, like straight line on it. Seems to be a bit more consistent. Done it again, I keep jumping too far off to the right. I'm okay, going point four around that one right hander. Lost about another point for that. A little bit faster. Not crazy, but it was a little bit. Uh we got I actually have no idea how much a road there's gonna be in the um in the actual race. I don't think they've they've mentioned it at all. Yeah, I'd be really annoyed if they had collisions on in qualifying to be fair. I find it annoying sometimes, even without the collisions, like just sitting behind someone and you can't see their ruts or anything through the uh, the roost or through their body. It's hella annoying. Six and a half minutes of quali left, and then I will go and have a wee, and then we'll quickly load up the racetrack and see just how much different it is. That's a really weird berm. It's like it's not really, not really banked enough to actually hold you as a berm would.
<laughs> Come on, boys, stop spreading false information. That just leads to more questions about it. There's no set time. They'll be out today. Or maybe at like 1, 2am, depending on where, you, where you're from. But just after this race. Track's fine. I think track's good. I think... Uh, oh, I've not seen the racetrack yet. But... The quality track alone seems to be quite technical to go fast on, so I'm hoping the racetrack will be more of the same, and then throw some, uh, slap some new road on there too, and it should be proper deep. I think Matley is quite a, a brutal track for the GP boys when they race. It seems to usually dig up quite deep. Uh, I don't think I have any gun boots, I'm afraid. I know the uh, red, I think is it red white rider or typical Canadian. I think it's Red Riders working on some at the moment. So worst case scenario, wait a couple of months probably, and there'll be some guns up. I think the skins that are out there for a model that was ripped from the, one of the Monster Energy Supercross games. So yeah, I don't know if the actual model itself exists. What are we working on here? If I got my deals are two oh eight eight, so it's not even like the potential for a lap's crazy high. I'm kind of running at an okay pace. So I have no idea what top's going to be. As I said, I wouldn't surprise me if someone goes nuts with like a, a 206. I'm talking, these are 250s I'm talking about. I'd be very surprised if I get top quality. It hasn't, hasn't felt insane. I mean, I'm, I'm point three up now. Try and hug this as tight as I can. Oh, yeah, that was really nice. Smooth. Look, I'm a second up. That shows how much potential there is. Oh, you bastard. Oh, save it. Save it. One point two seconds up. There's no way I finish this lap. It's going far too uh far too smoothly. This corner is awful, where it's slightly off camber and it's choppy and uphill all at the same time, just really wants to rip the bike out from underneath you. I'm going to lose a little bit of time in the last corner because I went far too far inside last time and somehow saved it. That was just a lucky save. Oh, never mind. I gained 0.2. Nice. Was that a second better? 208.3. There we go. Two minutes left of quality. Throw that out of the bag. It's quite nice. Oh, getting steezy for him as well. Look at that. <clears throat> yeah, I think the race day version might have, will have some pre-built uh, ruts in there. was a heater. It, it felt okay. It's definitely beatable. Oh, we've got Jay Mertz in it. There's the boy. There's so many like off camber uphill bits on this track that MX bikes just hate. It's not even the track's fault that there's some rough uphill, it is purely the game and the front end's getting all all sorts of wobbly. I 
Uh, uh, the reason I was looking back there is there's a little like inflatable thing on the side of the track with Higos stuff on it, and for some reason I thought it was in the shape of a doghouse, but it's not. See so yeah, up on the clip on the hill over there on the left hand side, just to my left now. We're only 16 seconds off our quality time, boys. We're gonna, we'll get it. We'll put it back in the last sector. Oh, damn! We said right. Since there's only 37 seconds left, and I ain't got time for another lap, I'm going to run to the toilet quickly, and then we're going to load up the race version and give it a go. BLB. Right, greetings, fellow gamers. <laughs> Shall I just pin a message? Hang on, let's go. Uh, live streaming. Um, two strokes come out whenever nobody knows the time. There we go. Let's go pin and hit you boys with an ad because I'm greedy. <laughs> oh, God. I don't think the ad plays for everybody. And I think a lot of it's just to do with the replay. Uh, you cannot get the McCreshans bikes. They are for the McCreshans riders only. They are not public. <laughs> ad block. Oh, you fucker. <laughs> You fucker, you're ruining me. <laughs> Alright, let me take a screenshot of that, just in case anything goes wrong. Oh, Neon didn't even get a timing. Maybe he's more of a, a Supercross guy. But, that to me, that says that that's done. So I'm backing out. I've got video proof, if anything goes wrong in the export. Um, so now I want to go to testing Great Britain Race. and slap like a little bit of a road on just to see what happens run a couple laps here before the um the race servers go up oh Caden, what a babe thank you <laughs> um how do you become a mccreations rider you'd really just have to get reached out to by mcchicken nobody that's ever asked to be on the team has got on it's who he wants to be on it who he reaches out to and luckily I pride myself in the fact that I got on the team before I started making YouTube videos. So it's not just my status. What is this what's this called by the way? Is it twenty That's how makes of nations? Oh, it's not under JV. Is it under twenty twenty three? No. Am I going blind? Unless it's under M. MXG, uh, no. M. So we've got Qatar. Don't want Qatar. Actually, that's the same setup anyway. Let's copy that one. Sure, we'll rock with that. Nice. Uh, why'd they put on my MXB that quality was now? I don't think they did, Stumpy. I don't think it specifies like an exact quality length at all. Oh god, that is a lot rougher. Holy moly. Okay, okay, race pace, hell of a lot slower. That inside line looks sexy. Right, let's um let's just get around the track first. Let's work out what we want to do. Thank you, by the way, Stumpy. 
Boing, boing. All right, we've got an inside line there. It will step up and over. Oh, I like this. Like that a lot. That outside could be quite, quite sexy. This is hella bumpy. Oh my god. Uh, what what class are you doing for GPs, Cam? I know that you've done 450s in the um, pre-season. Are you doing the same again, or are you sticking in twos? Uh, I'm not sure what the fastest quality time is just yet, Moped. I'm just going to wait, like, five-ish minutes to see the times. You are the big 450. Nice. Well, best of luck with that one, sir. I went for 250 just because I actually hate riding the 450s outdoors at the moment. Oh my god, this is treacherous. Jesus, that inside is going to be king again. That inside there is quite nice. You could go inside and move over to the right of the takeoff, I think, and still get the triple win. Okay. Could jump to the inside here. A lot of these ruts feel very similar to the um, Matley ruts on MX Simulator, just with how they're laid out. Oh my Jesus. Holy, right, let's go inside here. This inside looks hella OP. I feel like that might be a little bit one-lined. Same as that bit there. Oh, God. Yeah, I think insides are going to be king, if I'm honest. Uh, braces shouldn't be that far out, I don't think. Uh, quality's just finished, so they need to sort out servers and things like that. Uh, I'm not sure if they're going 250, 450, 250, 450 today, or if they're going to do them both at the same time. I would really like them to be at the same time, because then I get to go to the gym when all is said and done. Cause I, I like going to the gym at about 9pm-ish, my time, because it's just disgustingly busy any other time before that. If it gets like 9.30, 10 I'm usually there for like two hours or so, and then it gets a little bit late to be getting back and waking everybody else up else up in the house. That's a bit unfair. See so yeah, if it finishes about nine-ish, I'll be happy. God, those doubles are brutal. Oh, front end. Um, I cannot remember off the top of my head how much fuel I used for the pre-season race. 30 minute race use a lot more fuel than the, the 15 minute uh, supercross races. Oh, easy. Can we clear this in race version? No. God, this is brutal. I'm just going to have to really take my time. Let me see if I can hit this inside and then move out to the right. Oh, I didn't move very far over at all. Let's go again. Let's suck or rip. Uh, oh, the run's not ideal because you can't apex the corner. So I might Oh, transfer. Rip. Call me K-Dub. Yeah, I might have to go just outside of that and then go triple, triple. Or I've not even, I don't think I've even tried the left side through this section yet. So if we go inside, we go double. Was it double, double? <laughs> nope. Yeah, it's a bit of an L section. I'll stick to the right hand side. Right, let me... Do I have my MXB open? I don't. My MXB. Please, I don't have to log in, do I, to view like qualifying times? Uh, let's do sign-ups times and groups. Uh, nah, there's, there's, there's no point, Cam. I'm sure the race will be up soon. Oh, that's practice. I want race groups. 207, 207, 207. Oh, fucking hell, I qualified 10th. No, I didn't. I thought I was being stupid. I thought it was going to be like heat races. Qualified 5th, which is all right. That's surprising. D Mills must be an outdoors guy then, because I know he's, he tends to be quite a bit off the pace in Supi. It's actually quite stacked. Didn't know, didn't know that. Like, popped his rapid. 
uh, outdoors. Rax is really quick, Toxic's quick. Obviously we've got Chicken as always, Tyler J's been getting quicker and quicker, Crockett's been about for ages, so I'm sure he's going to be fast. Ginger's always quick, uh, all of the LMC boys are usually quite fast outdoors. So yeah, it's going to be it's going to be difficult. So what was I off? One point, ah, it's not too bad, 1.2 seconds, not the end of the world. Marco made it in. Uh... We got any other McCreations guys in here on 250s? Harry only just made it in, that's surprising. Who didn't? Senor didn't make it. Jarrett didn't make it. Well, actually, I say didn't make it, they're in. They're just in the B motors. See, I could have sandbagged. Just sandbag, go try and win B group, love, love in life. Jesus Christ, how many people have done laps? Uh, 165 people ran a lap time. That's crazy. Uh, let's just just check to make sure. No race servers aren't up just yet. Oh, 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 oh! Smig Dampers informed me of some good information. News. Scheduled nine. Is that <laughs> who's nine p.m. Is that though? Apparently they come out at 9, but I don't know if that's 9 my time, or 10 my time, or 8 my time. So they come out in a couple of hours at least. Or an hour or two. Let's go on the OEM website. Uh, is there a timer? Is there a countdown anywhere? No. Oh, yes, it's literally right there. One hour, 13 minutes. Okay. So, now, we can go. <laughs> Two strokes, release, at 9pm, GMT, paste. Uh, replace pin message. Yeah, you, give you an ad. <laughs> um, it would be nice if the bikes were more equal, just for difference in like colours and stuff on the track. I like, just seeing more variety because it gets annoying seeing like a sea of blue or a sea of red, for example. Um, but in terms of like gameplay, it doesn't matter too much for me. It'd just be nicer for the streams to see more colours as well. Second gear is a little bit too high RPM, and then third gear I feel like I'm not moving. I don't really want to mess with my gear in too much anyway, because it's what I'm comfortable with from Supercross, so it's a bit of a bit of a toughie. Ooh, I should see what the traction's like on the start, shouldn't I? Let's just push our bike up here. Do -do 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 -do. is hella pretty. Is there any downside to going far inside? Um, yes, you're not actually on the track. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. It's got a couple gates over. One, two, three, four, five, so it's like gate seven-ish. Okay. Oh, I need to put on my inputs. Inputs. There we go. Oh! There we go. It's so rolling backwards. Love that, Yorick. Thank you. Right. Oh, the thing is, I know that people are going to hate this race version because it actually forces you to slow down, down the hills and into the corners. Whereas the majority of the community on this game love just going as fast as possible everywhere. And I know full well that I'm going to get some 
weird and wild moments throughout this race where like the front end goes or the bike just falls out from underneath me because of the rough but I think oh I mean there you go speak of the devil but it's a good thing because it does force you to slow down can write the script sometimes does it itself Oh, I've got good news by the way as well boys, um, the guy who makes all the Racer X videos, um, like the pre-race stuff that has the MX bikes footage in the background that Stone Rider usually sends to him, um, asked me to send him this next one because it's on Daytona and obviously in, in game Day Daytona is the same as last year, uh, well IRL is the same as last year so I just got to ride last year's Daytona track and send it to him because then I don't get any like unfair practice on the aerial tracks, which is why I've not been able to do them, like, all, all the other ones. I know we're getting a different one in-game, but obviously for IRL, wait, they want the real layout to be shown on the Racer X video, so yeah, you'll see my footage in the Daytona uh, preview. So, big dubs. Back on the map. Race servers, thank you very much. See, don't need to look at Discord when i got you, boys. MXBGP MX2 Race Server A. That's me. Server A. Where's my phone? There it is. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think it's going to drop off of a cliff at all. Even with the slower updates. Um, how do we... Let's go... Um, MX Bikes Steam Charts. So, MX Bikes. Still, it's 2,000 people playing in the last, last day, to be honest. But uh, if we go back to when I started playing the game, which was here, as you can see, it's, um, it's definitely got a little bit more popular as time's gone on. If you can see that, let me zoom in. There you go. For it makes it a bit better. Compared to Monster Energy doo -doo -doo, Supercross 5, <laughs> that's a bit of a difference there. Or. Oh, it's not even on there. MX versus ATV Legends. Again. It's, uh,. It's pretty disgusting. So, yeah. Uh, 7.5 litres of fuel. I believe it. I'll rock it for the first moto. Why not? And we'll see how much we have afterwards. 7.5. Save. Put it as race. Race. Who knows? Maybe it'll be a mudder. We'll put it on wet as well. Save, save, save. Tyres. Cool. That's a lot of riders. Um... Gate. Sure. Point two. Oh, that's going to get deep after a 30 minute moto. Wait, how do you message people in... What? Oh, he's on the server side. You fucker chicken. Uh, messages. Where is he? Chick. There we go. Let the boss man know that I'm running stock. I just want to have a good night. I just want to have a good night. Hold up. I'd love them to make a rain round, like have it raining, have the road be proper deep, like pre-built ruts super deep as well. I think it'd be great. But I know that I am um, probably alone in that uh, in that opinion. Oh, they've got 
fucking respawn timers on. No. No. <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. Let me move my controller over there so you can see the timer when I crash. Ah, oh, why have they done this to me? Ah. Oh. What's the what's the news? VR done. Lay it on me. What's happening? What's popping? Now nah, zero point two after ten minutes of SX was basically nothing in two uh, fifties at least. Why are people riding the track? Do not ride track. <laughs> Punch of idiots. Ah, oh, you can tell you get some new people in these series. I just want to have a good night. Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, well done, man. Oh, it's ridiculous the amount of money that goes into pilot licenses. Glad you got it. Uh, I have the music on, Nick, just so in those moments where I'm going proper, like, try hard practicing, um, or just try hard racing, that it's not just dead silent. I know a lot of people like it, but I think the music's quiet enough. Right, no, fuck it. If everyone else is getting practice, so am I. I'm not losing out, just by being a good boy. B main Loki stacked. I didn't pay too much attention about who was in it. I've done it again. Right, I'm not going to launch to the uh, left-hand side of that hill. The old, uh, the old stocky soupy suspension can't take it. Oh, it's a little bit framey there. Hope it's not going to be like that throughout the entire race. Oh lordy! Yo, oh, yeet. Boing. Oh, is it a warm-up? Okay. Didn't know that was a thing. So I guess we are allowed on the track. Okay, well, I'm going to spin some laps. Okay, on the binders. Nice inside line. That outside looks quite spicy as well. We'll see how it goes. I'm sure lines will change as the race goes on, especially Moto2 when it gets super deep. Probably end up standing up around most of these corners uh, for Moto2. Boing. So yeah, I'm going to jump down to the, uh, the right side here if I can. A lot smoother. It's the inside like here as well. A little bit of a hook in it. Yeah, Daytona's the big boy. Would I be, um, will I be racing Daytona if I'm 250 East for NA? Or is that is that a West round? Some of you might think that's like a really stupid question, but being from the UK, I don't know all of my um, all my e, my US USA locations. <laughs> ah, thank you very much. That's scary going down there where it's on an off camber. I don't know how much off camber turn and experience you boys have, but the bike never seems like it's going in the direction you want it to go. Yo, yeet. Jeez. Oh, look how long this respawn is. Holy shit. The only reason, the, the one benefit I, I have from the respawn delay is if someone else crashes, you have a chance to like 
avoid them without them instantly respawning and riding sideways. That is the only one. When you're on the, the end of it, when you've got to sit there for four seconds. Oh, it's frustrating. I, I know it adds a level of realism. Uh, it gives you more reason to not crash. But goddamn, hella annoying. Slow it down. Up late. Oh! Far right hand side made that a bit easier to double. Noted. Noted, noted, noted. Standing up's going to be my friend, I think, throughout these races. Oh, already it seems to be the, uh, the way around some of these rougher corners. Getting this tight inside line down here as well. Transfer to the outside. It'll triple. Oh, yeah, I should try transferring over there and getting that inside rut. Oh, God. Bloody garage alarms going off. I'm racing. Oh, sorry. Just had the back door open. Dad is home. He can sort it out. Not my job. Someone trying to steal my motorcycles whilst I'm racing. That's very un unkind. Oh, why did my front end go there? That's worrying. Damn, only three seconds off of Jay's lap. Holy moly. That didn't feel like a terrible lap. Can't remember if I uh, crashed or anything. I mean, I just gained 0.8 in one corner. Cheeky little transfer. Can I make it to the inside? Oh, barely. Too bad, actually, I'm 1.4 seconds up now, so. Excuse his barking as well. Oh, Mateo's gone up by four seconds. I'm going to have to rely on consistency today, same as always. Beep beep. Come through. Oh no! <laughs> oh, I was moving. I would have been like three seconds up there. I turned into prime axle for a second there. Oh. Completely forgot that collisions are a thing, now we're in the race server. Yeah, you boys will get to go and enjoy the two strokes while I'm sitting here doing a race. And then I'm going to the gym afterwards, I can't even enjoy him after that. I've already got a video sorted for tomorrow, so tomorrow's video isn't going to be uh, on the new two strokes, but the day afterwards probably will be. Warm-up is over. Does that mean we're uh, going to be going?
Well, Nico's sinking in, so I'm guessing we'll be going after he joins. Yeah, well, if it's finished by like 9.30, it's, it's 8pm now. If it's finished by like 9.30, then I'll go. It's, it's nice when the gym's quiet. Yeah, 24 hour gym. All, all well and good until you get trapped under a, uh, until you get trapped under a weight by yourself. To be fair, I don't think the track is that narrow. Like if you was to line us up on our bike side by side, there's probably plenty of room. I think it's just narrower than what the, the typical, typical national tracks are. It's not like it's a super wide highway IRL. It's going to be a, a bunch of that tonight, I think. Race time. Let's go. Sea of red. Oh, nice custom gates as well. Love that. God, 30 minutes is such a long race as well. Let me take, oh, take my ring off. Nice and comfy. Wipe the hands. Oh. Fuck's sake. What's going on now? Served it. We've had to restart the whole server because one person left and rejoined. Are you shitting me? Oh. Has he put down all the servers? Or have servers just died? Um. Uh. Mm. Next DGP. Please join again. The warm up mode was preventing people to join. Ah, so he's doing all the servers. That's fair enough. I'm sure if it was me that uh, left and couldn't rejoin, I would ex I would want the same thing. There we go. Right. MX to server A. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't be that much better, eh, killer, if you can't even get his name right. You can't fan over somebody whose name you can't spell. What's going on? Oh, here we go again. Uh, if you're speaking like Lou, if you're on about like gym stuff, I just cycle like three days push pull legs. So I try and try and cover all my bases. Well, I won't lie, I did uh, I did skip my first leg day the other day already. Oh yeah, I don't I don't know if we're getting any um new sounds for the two strokes. It'd be nice, but I've not heard anything about it. I think Bayer really is the only person with the, the proper abilities to make new ones and to my knowledge he's not like that active anymore. Yeah, 
I've got quite, oh, I've got pretty strong legs naturally, so luckily I've not got to work on them much. Like my calves and quads are really, really good. So I can get away with skipping the odd leg day. I do um I do go out for like walks and runs for my cardio, but I was I was pissed off today, so I went for like my normal walk, which is it's not like a massive like walk by any means, it's three, four K, like it's not that big, but just to get myself moving. And my plan was to come home and do like a 30, 40 minute session on Zwift on my indoor exercise bike. And for some reason it will not hook up. I think it's to do with my uh like the Ant Plus wire that goes into it, the Bluetooth thing. It's not at, uh, not picking it up, so yeah, kind of kind of slacked today, which is unfortunate. Do people not realise that you can't really ride on the track anymore? Like it's not a warm up anymore. <laughs> Everyone's like practicing on these gates as well, like. They're proper fucking up these lines. Should I, should I still be taking this? Because my gate might be um, gate might be dookied. That looks like a lot of people that are all synced to me. Wait, wait, fuck! <laughs> I'm waiting on one person. Always one. Who's the one? Uh, Nolan's launches are allowed, I don't believe. Like this is this has never been a thing before, by the way. Like people practicing starts and going on the actual track. So I, I don't know why. Um, I don't know why it is now all of a sudden. Can't even practice starts for my thing because I have a different technique than just going. <laughs> uh, Lynn's launch was a very OP start technique. The Apparently it was too strong and they wanted to ban, even though everybody was able to do it. A few people had a little bit of a cry because I had a few good starts in a row. It's Ginger that we was waiting on. What is this? We're in a quality pre-start, but Ginger's sinking. They fucked up the server. Oh no, practice was only five minutes. Oh, oh well. They're on it. They're fine. Now is Ginger going to be able to join? In that MMR started slowly going down more and more. As I keep getting beaten in races. <laughs> oh. Alright. Ginger's in. Bad times need another Wii. But, we move. No, I'm not doing a tutorial on that. I just abuse it in online lobbies now. Can't do it in official races. 
Da 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 da. Not not quite as simple as that always blue, but kind of along the along the right line. Oh, come on boys, let's get this rolling. Is it 30 plus 2 as well? Oh yeah, I'm probably not going to be going to the gym tonight. Oh. Bloody cold as well in my room. Should have put a jumper on or something before all this started. Oh, hands are going to go cold. I need to move about a little bit. That gate one is so cheeks. You see how much damage they've done to these uh, first few gates, actually. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's why all of my mistakes usually come at the start of a race. For some reason I just go really cold in between, where we take so long in between races and joining servers and stuff. Then once we're like halfway through the race I actually get a bit of a flow going and I'm fine. So I always pull in a reverse Chase Sexton. Uh, no, I didn't go to Hawkson. where we just turn into a bike life session again because we have to wait for ages. Straight out I'm wearing Poboso gear. Oh, she's a bit rough off the track. <laughs> hey! Hopefully we get to race this time. Lovely stuff. Um, one, two, three. Oh, I can't remember if I chose gate four or five, actually, but I'll take it. This one looks pretty decent. Yes, luck needed. Very, very long race. Probably about 35 minutes in total. So, if it all falls apart in the first lap, I know that I just need to chill out a bit. <laughs> I can't believe we've almost got 500 people in here, which is pretty disgusting. But I think I know first rounds of series usually do that well, so thank you everyone that is here. Alright. Race time, my boys. I have to shove here because people are turning right when there's a left hander. You know what? I'll take it. 
don't know if that was Mateo or well, it was one of the people that was on my inside, but no idea who. And that was my fault. Fuck. Oh, thank God, that wasn't a very long. Um, that wasn't a very long wait. Right, we are in about P6, and for a first lap, I'll take it. Just don't want to get cross jumped or anything like that. Just can take it nice and easy. Oh, chickens up here. Love that. Whoever's in the lead is gone. Like, gone, gone. Oh, chicken ping doing chicken ping things. Gonna be quite scared to, uh, to get near him. All of his movements are so over exaggerated because of the net code, it's so funny. Side rock. I can. Uh oh. Done exactly the same thing as Steiner did there. Why the fuck is my. Oh, okay. Okay. Thought I could have got away with that. So, watch again. Check. Save track entry, please. Well, that was unfortunate. I could have been in P2. Uh, it said I'm in at P7. I'm so scared riding around people. Surprise chicken is doing 250s. Been a long time since I've seen him on a uh, small bike. Not the line that I wanted to take. Damn, Hakon is gone in the lead. Oh, fuck off. Two seconds. It's so frustrating with these respawns, man. They make the little slip offs like that so much more, uh, so much more costly. It's fine, we'll get a bit of a groove going at some point. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, I'm so sorry, Ginger. Don't know why my front end went there. Felt like I didn't do anything wrong. Come on, pull your shit together. See, I feel awful there because that's given Ginger like a three second respawn delay as well, something that was completely on me. Just saw that he was going out wide and I thought I could go under the inside of him. Let's see what the, uh, oh god, see what the time difference is when I get across the line. My Max HUD has stopped moving, which is concerning. There's Pastry. Just follow him. I think he's the. Uh, he's probably going to be the fastest man on track. So. We are 22 seconds down in P8. That is not very bueno. Let's straight line this. Lovely. Get on the brakes. Oh, 
I mean, we've got a hell of a long time to uh, get them 20 seconds. I'm sure if people start messing up, we'll be okay. Yeah, it was like this crash here last lap was so weird. I mean, yeah, the respawn timer is just a get good thing, to be honest. I mean, it's the same for everyone. I just I don't like the inconsistencies of it from the game. If it was just like a set three seconds always, I wouldn't mind it as much. But where it's variable based on speed, and that speed can be changed like netcode and things like that, that's when it gets a little bit, a little bit sus. Oh, God, itchy knows this is awful timing. Have to try and scratch it over a big jump. No, get back on the inside rope. There we go. Oh, it's hella itchy. Hella itchy. No, I'm doing it now. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a bad time to do it. Right into all the braking bumps. All right, we're Gucci. Oh my god. <laughs> that was a hell of a dive to the inside. Twenty one point six. Oh, Jay has gone uh, tripping, stumbling. God, that's sketchy down there. I'm interested to see how long it takes before we have to uh, move out of some of these lines. Everyone's going inside here, I feel like I should try it. That's not bad at all actually. to check up there. Front end tried to go. God, that is scary, man. We're back to our friend Chicon. Gained a second on the lead a little up. Damn, Brophy's in P4, he's barking. Good ride from him. Where do I pass is the question. I'm not jumping off of this too far because I'll land on that awful rough on the in on the outside. That's all right. Made a mistake himself. Lovely. I think that's us up into P4. Nose is itching again. I can do it on this straight. It's fine. Scratch, 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 scratch. Oh.
That's what I mean. We've had all the mistakes earlier on in the race, and now it's kind of settled down a little bit. Oh, we're easy. Feel like I might be jumping into that a little bit too deep. Keep this in second gear rather than third, so I can limit my speed. Gaining some time on the lead, which is nice. I think he's making some mistakes. Fifteen point two, nice. It was like twenty-one earlier. We've still got eighteen and a half minutes plus two laps to go. We are strapped in for the long haul here, folks. Five hundred and thirty people watching me do this. Thank you very much for being here. Alright, nice and easy down the hill. We might have to switch from this inside line. The the very entrance of it is starting to get a bit of a hook. And I feel like it's going to uh, kick the front end out any one of these times now. So I'll take it once or twice more if I get a little bit sketchy on it. Then I'll switch out to the middle or the outside. Uh, there's only one more motor off this, just two motors. Give me too many seconds of cuts. We are gaining time as well, gaining about a second a lap right now, which is great. I just don't think that we've got 13 laps left. So I would like some mistakes out of the, uh, the top boys if possible. forwards this time. I wheelied up here last time, done it again, doesn't matter. Even while leaning forwards. 12, or gained like two seconds last lap. Let's go. Right, I'm just gonna nice and easy into this right hand up. There we go. I think, oh, even if I don't switch my line, as long as I slow down a little bit going into it, it should be okay. These two boys are in a bit of a heated battle. That's not very nice, eh, Killer? Where's the, where's the support? Both got hella sketchy. Yeah, I didn't want to force up. 
I also didn't want to try the outside when I've not taken it once yet. Going outside in the corner because I overjumped the jump. Don't you dare. Oh. Random, random bits like that. I'm not sure why the front end decided it didn't want to uh, be my front end anymore. To be fair, you know what they say, a P2 in Moto 1 is as good as a win. So if we can get that P2, I'd be a very happy man considering where we were at. Oh. Hold on to her. Looks like everyone's starting to get a little bit sketchy now. Oh, we've got the drive, should have this inside. I'm sorry, Starner. Not much I could do about that. Didn't have a chance to save it. It makes me feel worse about getting into people now for crashes with this bloody respawn timer. fighting that. Back to fourth. Oh, don't, 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 don't. Oh. Oh. It's getting sketchy. Come on, get going. What am I doing? I had a nice, uh, nice little while there for the first, well, for like 10 minutes or so, and now it's it's gone all sketchy again. I'm going to drop seven seconds on the lead, oh god. It's going to give Hakon a bit of uh, a bit of confidence in Moto2, which we don't want. And we got left. So what, 12 minutes past two to go? Oh my god. Why don't you really fall out of the sky on that triple? Oh, he made a mistake. We gained four seconds on him, so he's human. I also just saw our first uh, first lap up coming up. Oh, it's fucking crashes like that where they happen so good. It cost me four, probably five seconds by the time I get up and going. They're so frustrating. Oh, it's, give me a consistent time for a crash just so I know what to expect. I think I'm just trying to, uh, might be trying to push it a little bit too hard. I still get that P2, which is going to be the important thing. But I uh, sort my shit out, because I, I gained so much on them. And then I, now I've caught up to them, it's kind of messed with my flow a little bit, so... Try and get the flow back. So weird seeing D-Mills this high up after he's one of the uh, first people to get lapped in Supi all the time. And that's not meant to be a dig by any means, it just shows that different people prefer different uh, sorts of racing. Frontman doesn't want to stay in that inside rut.
jumping off the side of the track. Damn, I lost nine seconds on that last lap. Lots of mistakes. Try not to turn too tight in this corner again. Lovely. Oh, it's yellow flags up ahead. What's going on down here then? That is D Mills, I think. I think he rides a husky. Maybe? Not, not sure. Apparently I'm in P2 now. What's happened? No, oh, never mind, I'm being an idiot. D-Mills was on a Honda, he's the one crashing, but on the hill, the Husky's a lap that's just got going again. Oh, I've got it now. Makes sense. Be nice if we could close this gap to the lead a little bit just to like let him know that we was there. Right, I need to turn tighter here because it keeps pushing me out over the berm. Lovely, that was really nice. Stand up round here as well. Seven and a half minutes plus two. It's a long time left. He's made a mistake because I'm only nine seconds off now. I think he's one of them two there. I also feel like I'm ripping tear offs far too quickly. I'm surprised I've got any left. Maybe if he's uh, got Max HUD on and he can see the, see the time going down, maybe he'll start getting a little bit nervous and make more mistakes. lines I'll be taking around there. I'm kind of like just missing the ruts. I'm not getting, uh, not sinking into them. Uh oh, oh, that's all right. Downside of the bump, luckily. I know that uh, Reaper's streaming 450s, so it's going to be quite fun going back and watching what they were like around it. That is a good track entry, that is. Shout out that man. Love to see that. Didn't rush on track. Looked around, was aware. Oh, keeper. Keeper on, keeper on. We are gaining time. Love that. Love that for me. Come on, Axel. Be nice to me. Should pass him here on the inside. Lovely. And we've got a good chunk of time behind us as well, so I may as well go for it. Six point six seconds. Come on. He's been leading the entire race. He'd be devastated if he threw it away now. That'll come in a bit hot, bit hot, bit hot. It's fine. Not going to lean over too far. Nice and easy. There we go.
I'll see him at the top of this hill. That was a very annoying slide out to have. The slapper gives me the, uh, the inside line up here. Doesn't matter because I went over it anyway. Thank you, buddy. Shifting up to third there stops the uh, the wheeling so much. Right, 6.1 seconds, four laps to go. One and a half seconds a lap. Wait, sorry I like this guy last lap, unless it was someone with a very similar name. Oh, this is... Boys, this is what lapping should be like. That was sexy. The, shout out to those two. Big dubskies. Lappers are getting my hopes up, I'm thinking it was the leader. He's gone down. I think that was the leader there. God, keep her on track. I think that was. I think I just played the pass for the lead. We'll find out as soon as we hit this jump. Did indeed. Is that the real Pele? Thank you very much, Carla. Lappers have been amazing this race. Like, really fucking good. That jump to the inside is getting a little bit sketchy now. Oh, getting some death holes up here. Oh, 
not even gonna bother fighting for that inside. We're gonna leave it, we're gonna go round it. It's going to be a good battle for the lead on the last two laps, isn't it? <laughs> you see how hard I was like fighting with the bike to not crash there to avoid getting a four second penalty? I'm dead. I'm not dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm alive. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Some horrible kicks. And now I'm dead. Ah! It's just. Oh, they're such stupid crashes, man. It's uh, amplified a lot more in the 450s, that's why I'm not riding them. But see, the front end never really is attached to the ground, it'll just fall out from underneath you. Oh, I've got one and a half laps to go. We just need to see if Hakon will make a mistake. If he does, great. If he doesn't, P2 and Motor 1 is really not bad. I might as well send it, to be fair. I've got 20 seconds behind me. Oh, he's dead. I've already said, Jesse, that I'm already a, a chase exon. I usually just make my mistakes at the start of the race rather than at the end. Yeah, consistency do be an issue. Just trying to accept it a bit more now and Hopefully get better at it rather than getting too frustrated at it. I'll try my best. Neither of us want to win it though, that's for sure. Oh, he's made more mistakes. Oh, he's crashed loads. Okay, right. One lap to go. Oh, I'm trying my best, man. Come on. Six hundred and fourteen people here, by the way. Just glimpsed over at that. Right, I'm rolling this. I do not want my back end kicking any way whatsoever. Jesus. There we go. Thank you, everyone that is in here watching this. I do appreciate it. The annoying thing is, if I do win this moto. It's all downhill from it, like it can't get better. <laughs> so we've kind of, we've done well too early on. I bet the track has deformed incredibly, by the way. Like, what a good track for racing, multiple lines. JV should uh, give himself a bit of a pat on the back. To be fair, I don't even think, well, we'll find out, but with how the road's got so far, I don't even know if you'd need to change your lines for Moto2. I think you can still ride them, just stand up more. So I'm stood up all the way around this corner, all the way around this one as well, just stand up, wait the outside peg. Sit down going into this one, but you see it kind of smooths out into the rut here. Kind of get the power on, stand up again over the bumps. Just going to go outside here. Two corners to go. 
I have no idea how I managed to come back and win this, but big dub. Throw a little bit of steez, throw a Superman for the fans. Can we backflip this? Oh, it's not going to rotate around, I don't think. Oh, it's done it. Lovely. Oh, may have won, but I still prefer Supercross. That is my only one. Yeah, first, no, first, first win of the year. Here we got here. What was the score? Hack on second. Uh, Steiner third. Pang. Is that Pankaka? Fourth? I think it's Pank. Oh, that's a long gap back there. See, this is what I'm saying. It's like, I'm not trying to throw shade at people, but if we go off qualifying lap times. Oh, it's Panda. I didn't even know Panda was doing this. Um, Mateo was second. Jay was first. So there's, there's a massive difference in terms of race speed and one lap speed. The chicken was 16th. Holy sugar. Yeah, good stuff. Did I get any cuts? I didn't get any cuts either. That was surprising. I did have a few, uh, few off-track excursions there. And, oh yeah, boys, you, you lot get to uh, enjoy the two strokes in three minutes as well. Well, I'm glad you boys enjoyed racing it. We've still got a Moto2. No, no, Boko. It's a real track. Like, Winchester itself is based off of a real track. It's Matterley Basin in the UK. No worries, you boys enjoy the two strokes uh, coming out in a couple, maybe like in two minutes. But yeah, I am going to be doing Moto 2, which probably will start in about five minutes or so. They usually don't give us too much time. I had two litres of fuel left, so I do not need that much. Let's just go to six and a half. Lovely. Yeah, both based off of a real track. The thing is, whilst it was a good race coming back from, I think I was in like 10th at one point, I was the reason that I went down to 10th. Like, it was my own fault and my own crashes. Thank you for all the new subs in here, by the way. Do appreciate it. Uh, yeah, the track track's played. The track is paid for. I think they're all... Are they two dollars or one dollar fifty? Might be two dollars. Yeah, I think they're all two dollars. But you get two tracks. You get a qualifying version, which is smoother, um, and then you get a race version, which is the one that you just saw there. There's a few people upset about the delay, but oh, it's alright. Significantly cheaper in the long run. If you're... oh yeah, I did forget that there was a season pass, so I think it's twenty four dollars for the season pass, and I can't remember how many rounds are there are, but there's more than twelve rounds. Well, let me just dismiss that. I'll get rid of that. Uh, oh, no, it's fine. Never mind. I was going to delete the uh, message, but I can't. Oh, that's where I need to shake the hands out a little bit. Thank you very much, Finn. I won't lie, Finn. I think you would have been right up there if you was racing this.
it doesn't surprise me. I guarantee so many people are refreshing MXB mods right now trying to get them. Oh. Even just just wait like half hour if you can't get on. You, you'll be able to get on it eventually. It's not like like the world's not going to end because you had to wait half hour longer to get some two strokes. Uh oh. Well, it's probably not going to start because people are uh, people are sinking in. But I am going to go to the gate, just in case. <clears throat> if it doesn't restart, then I feel sorry for, uh, for Ginger. But we shall see. Oh, I'm still trying to get over the first race. I ain't got it in me to go again. So I wheelied last time. So I need even less throttle than I did. Uh, you'll probably find when you drag the stuff over, it will ask if you want to replace the files and just say yes. Right, so if this is the race, wish me luck, but I have a feeling it will get restarted. If not, Ginger's been done dirty there. try going outside at the bottom of this hill. I feel like no one's really going to take it. Oh. Hakon's gone straight on. Oh. Oh, Mateo's out in front. He could run away with that. Mateo, Steiner, and then your boy. God, that jump started booting me to the moon. What's that? Valentin. Oh, he's barking that inside. Be a follow leader for it. Oh god. A little bit of a twitch going into that corner. I'm not a fan of that. Oh god, the boys. <laughs> Nobody's liking this off camera corner at all. Like it might be too far gone now for him to restart it. I'm gonna have to stretch this rather than scrubbing it. Oh god, I cross jumped. Oh, don't know if he was already going down or if that was my fault. God, I'm such an L gamer. Oh god, hold on to him, too. Try doubling over that. I mean, it worked, but ugh, got a sketchy kit. In that first section, he right on my ass again after making a mistake. I 
I wonder how aggressive he'll try and be on passing, because I won't lie. I'm happy just going to slower race pace and letting him make mistakes. I think he's going inside here and then moving over to the right. Yeah. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Pretty sure he got into the back of me in the air, which is why I died. But I fell a kick. It's a long race. So, oh, settle in for the night shift. I'm just going to go outside down here. Screw it. I'm going to have a battling with that inside rope. No! Ooh, saved it. I always like being the hunter rather than the hunty. I have someone right on my cheeks, but... Oh, yeah, I mean... See, that was such a fast crash, and it only was two seconds, but I've had some that are like four. Make, make the respawn timers make sense. I'm drinking hella steezy. I think Jay's another one as well that doesn't have much patience when it comes to making passes, so he'll just go for it if it's there. Which I need to be wary of. Oh, red flag. Not red flag, yellow flag. Come on, Mateus, the second fucking time you've crossed over on me and taken me out. God, I hate people that are so aggressive. Just chill out a bit, man. Well, I know you're quicker, but damn. <laughs> Don't ride in me. starts to go downhill and then I'll find my flow about five minutes in You can't put links in the YouTube chat. Please stop trying, it auto deletes them. You can see them, but no one else can. Just literally wait for the website to not be shitting itself and you'll be fine. Your lives will not end because you haven't got the two strokes the nanosecond that they release. That's weird. Damn, I really didn't know that I'd fell 14 seconds back. That's huge. Let me buy. Oh, Brovy, thank you, man. That's your spot. You haven't got to do that. Oh, 
good guy, Broby. Just gonna experiment real quick. Yeah, staying out of that rock. Much better. Very, very close to going over that. Flag. That's all right. He's going again. That's us into P3 somehow. And if so, I would still get the overall, I think, finishing in third behind these two. So it was Hakon in second and Steiner in third in the first race. Let's see how the race goes. I mean, literally only 10 minutes deep. The race is so long. Oh god. God, I need to be careful jumping too far right there, I keep doing it. Don't you dare. Oh god. Okay, just going. All you can do in that situation is let go of the analog stick and pray. Whilst I would also be happy getting the overall, I would ideally like as big of a points lead as possible. I think Matteo and Jay are uh, dangerous when they're in this position when they've got a clear track in front of them because they definitely have the faster lap times.
they're in a very good battle, 0 0.1 seconds in it. I think Jay made a mistake in the lead because I uh, gained on him slightly. Don't know what I was getting a yellow flag there for, literally nothing's happened. Oh, never mind. I think Jay crashed. I should try that inside one lap because everyone else seems to be taking it except me. I'm always scared trying new lines mid motor. Duck. <sighs> and four seconds. So yeah, these crashes happen so quickly. And I don't, um, yeah, I don't feel like I was really doing anything different that corner than last time. So no, that's also the issue that I have in Supercross is uh, one lap I'll hit a section fine, next lap I feel like I'll hit it identical, and I'll just get thrown to the ground. Just trying to recognise that that turning point of when the road completely changes. Can't be that long these races, I've still got 15 plus 2. Try this inside. Nope, too fast. Didn't lose me too much time, thankfully, and Valentin, who was behind me, has made a mistake and crashed. Yeah, I was having that. Well, it's about to say you have no idea how gentle I'm trying to be on the sticks, but you can literally see my, my button inputs, so that was an ill comment. Trying to lean over so carefully in these deep ruts so my front end doesn't just knife on me. You fucker. Ah, oh, and facing the wrong way. Oh, and spin around quickly, pull on the track, we'll try not to crash. Ah. Oh. My bike feels hella rigid. I feel like it can't absorb anything. I'm having to ride around every bump possible, but I feel like I should be able to take one or two of them. Apparently I'm only eight seconds down, even after I... This is annoying, like, if I hadn't had that crash, I'd be like four seconds behind right now. So, no, never mind, it's just updated to 16. <coughs> ignore, ignore me.
Let's try this inside again. Uh, it was okay. I felt like I went super slow into it. I actually think some parts of the track that were rough are now getting smoother again because of how much they've been ridden. Who's made a mistake out in front? We've still got a chance as long as we uh, ride sensibly. I mean, that, I think that's Mateo that's crashed there. So this all, these are the leaders and the lapper, I think. Find out when we go over the jump at the top of this hill. Yeah, there's. I think they might have cuts as well. There's no way I'm only 1.7 seconds behind them, too. Oh my god! What? That was a disgusting take-out. Don't know if they've got together that's warranted that, or if Matteo is just being that aggressive this race, but... Damn. Hope Jay doesn't <laughs> take his anger out on me. Oh, this, uh, this lap here in front of me is... on, uh... Oh, on his team. Fuck, got to take the left side, that's annoying. Yeah, Axel was on Mateo's team, so it wouldn't surprise me if there was some sort of team tactics as he still sits in the main racing line. That's kind of scummy. As, if I recall correctly, Axel was actually a good lapper last moto. So, uh when his teammate wasn't in a battle for the lead, so that's convenient. Oh, Axel, fuck off! What are you doing? Jesus Christ. Oh damn, back to eight seconds down. Right, now I just have to hope that these two make mistakes really that's all I can do just need to ride my race six and a half minutes plus two to go 
This one's been more stressful. Oh, God. Oh, that sent me to the moon. Oh, I need new pants. Mine are fully brown. Go in a straight line, you shit cunt. Ah. Le least consistent rider on the planet. I really don't feel like the track's even much different from last moto. Might as well be riding the Titanic right now. This bike is feeling a hella sluggish and just I feel like every single bump's going through my body. Alright, gentle on the transition from right to left, or my bike will do a bloody disco ball dance. somebody less happy to get an overall in my life than me. Do be like that. Going on. Yellow, false yellow, yellow no matter. And I was waiting to get fucked by that bike. Guess I'm going outside now. Now, don't like it. Different line. I mean, might have been faster if I'm honest. Felt pretty fast.
Shout out Family Guy Racing. Love that. I'm trying, Cam. Not had an ideal race this moto, but we're still on for the overall. I just uh, would like to have a few more points in the bank, but we move. I think it's last lap round, next lap. Oh, well that's hella annoying. I definitely had chances of, uh, of winning this race. Unless uh, both Jay and Mateo have absolute dog shit last two laps. I uh, can't see this one being a dubski. This is Jay's bike right here. It is. The guy who came second in. The last race is in ninth or tenth now, so that's pretty good. Oh, back end's killing me, man. Jay made another mistake, so P2 should be in the bag. Unless any more LMC lappers want to uh, try and hold me up again.
Oh, chicken's down horrendous by the looks of it. So am I. Fuck me, man. And that's second place. I got one here because I was guessing I was going to get cuts. So there goes P2. Unless J has cuts. We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll find out. Oh my god, chicken! <laughs> chicken looking hella ropey. What's the gap behind me? 15? Ah, oh, i got time. Oh, Jay does have cuts actually. So all I've got to do is sit on his cheeks. And we should be okay. Well, you can have it. I don't want it. I'll happily cross the line right behind him if I need to. Everyone's getting cuts on this track. So I feel like I've been flirting with the outskirts quite a lot, and I've been uh, been okay. Yeah, I think Jay's got. Two seconds. Although he is, uh, he is schmoving, trying to get two seconds ahead. I crashed. I was going to let him by. I thought he was going to try to take him out. There we go. Big dubskis. El Axel. El Mateo. Bit dirty, but it's fine. Let's see what he says. Mm. W track. W track overall. I think that JV done an excellent job of that. Like, really, really, really good job. Um, yeah, I think there was some team tactics. Jay seems to agree with me that it was a bit sus that Axel was holding us up, but let the teammate buy us. So we got the overall. I don't know how many points. Um, so Mateo went 5 1. I went 1 2. I think Jay went like 10 3. Panda went 4 5. Hakon went 2 9. Steiner went 3 12. <laughs> So there was lots of up and downs in there. I don't think I've ever seen Chicken have such a tough time as in that race, but I mean, it is what it is. I mean, 20, oh, Jesus. I mean, 25 people finished, I think. That's a lot of dis. Oh, actually, that's a lot of D DNSs. I didn't know that many people left after Moto 1. Um, but wait, so time's 9.40 for me now. I'm not going to leave. Uh, I'm not going to go to the gym. There's really zero point. It is what it is, but I'd be home far too late. Tomorrow's video, it is a two-stroke video, but it's not the new 250 pack video because I just wouldn't have had time. So expect that the day after. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Thank you everyone for uh, stopping by as always. I do appreciate it. And I will catch you in tomorrow's video. <laughs>